Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna be organizing the DCP wall. As you can tell, I have sold some trucks. There's some empty spaces. Um, so right now, I actually, uh, two of these are brand new. These two right here. I've got this blue leasing uh, cab over. That's my newest one with a frameless round end dump. And then I've got this bottle all blacked out. So sick. I actually ended up um, getting these on a trade with some guy on the page, on the DCP page. And smooth trade. I love these trucks. Um, I've got an Elin right here. I've got a Jake Transport. I've got another Jake Transport. I used to have the complete set of the Lindas, but I ended up sell. I, I actually, yeah, I ended up selling the Low Boy. That was right here, the maroon Low Boy from Linda Mood. I sold that one. I ended up keeping the baby blue and this uh, darker blue one. Um, those two are my favorite. I love the design on them. Um, Honestly, the other one just looks like any other low boy. And these, I don't know, the decals on them is pretty sick. And actually this one, I had two of the same one in this set right here. The other set that I sold actually came with the original box. It was complete with its original packaging. And actually I had got that other one this baby blue Linda and I think that was it yeah those two I had gotten uh, from actually uh, the Linda Mood family out in Texas and this one actually was uh, broken uh, the step box on the other side was missing I believe the tire on the other side was missing as well and the bumper as well as you can as you can tell I put an uh, aftermarket bumper on it. I actually made it myself. Um, I put some uh, blue jewels on it. And then I ended up putting um, on the mirrors, uh, the orange one, the orange little jewels to make it look like uh, amber uh, watermelons. What else did I put? Some of the jewels. I know I put more on this truck. I just don't know where. Oh well, anyways, I have a Fleener. I had been looking for this one for a minute and I finally had found it. I got this off of eBay and I've got a jewel up there. Check this baby out. I've got a J Transport, boys. Just look at that baby. What, well, mamas? I got it. Huh? I got it. You got it? You gonna vacuum? You gonna help mommy? Okay, sorry. Beep beep. Anyways, guys, um, I got this Jade Transport from one of my good buddies, um, Sean. Thank you for this truck, brother. I've been wanting this truck for a minute. I love Jade's trucks. Original packaging, original set. I think it's just beautiful. Got another one of my favorites right here. This Western stretched double hump fenders, turbo wing, the exhaust, look at the exhaust on that thing. Original packaging, original set, has not been opened. And then of course, one of my favorites from Roadworks is this one right here, their first set that they came out with. This baby, I love it. So back to the wall guys. I just put in this set right here. And this truck right here, that Cummins, I custom made that one and I custom made this one right here. I made this one uh, to be a replica of my actual Ram. I'll put a picture. Right after this, so you guys can see. And of course, can't forget the all time favorite Ford Lightning. 
Just like my real one. Then I've got a Cheyenne up here with the gooseneck on a dually that I custom made as well. Lifted it, put some uh, forces on it, and custom made this one as well. Lifted it, put forces on it, put a tip on it on the back. Got the color of money. I've got an LCMB cattle pot. I've got a Duran Transport right here that my buddy gave me. Got a Western, got the Pac-Man. Uh, I'm not sure what company this is, but I've got that one. <laughs> I've got this one too. Big Daddy from Bottomley. Got another Elon right here. Can't forget that STS, baby. That thing is beautiful, man. Look at that thing. It's just gorgeous. Look at that. I love this truck right here, man. I love all these trucks. All of these. And I've got more. I've got another truck right here with the car hauler and my lowriders on it. I think I'm going to put that one in the case as well. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to put it down here. That'll fit good there. By the way, guys, um, these two up here are fully custom trucks. Uh, this one was made, I think it was Cody Jenks. That's who I bought it from. Beautiful truck. Custom bumper. Got the jewels on it. Custom stacks. Decals. Stretched. Double hump fenders on the back with the spread axle. And then this one right here, I made myself. This was actually my very first custom that I made. This was actually the drop that came. Um, when they came out, actually, this drop right here, when they were released, um, my brother, my buddy, and myself got one. And actually my, actually, my buddy got me this one and gave it to me. He gifted it to me. And uh, ended up stretching the baby ended up uh, putting some longer tips on it dropped it from the front put a custom bumper on it and that's about it for that one the trailer is pretty stock i haven't done anything to it and then i've got that custom build right there as well another cummins with the lift check out the bottom pretty badass and i put this in the case as well this definitely definitely needs to go in there i would put these two in the case but they don't fit because of the stacks the stacks are way too tall on these things so they're not gonna fit in the case because the spacing on there right here those those things are too tall all right let's put this thing over here Grab a lowrider. This lowrider, the suspension actually goes up and down, guys. Look at that. So sick. Got one of my favorite Impalas right here. This is a dream car right here. Literally a dream car. And let's grab this Impala right here. One of my other all-time favorites right here. All right, guys. Now that's a full truckload right there. Heading to the Las Vegas Super Show. What's up? Look at that. Our nice 359. The nice color combo on the paint. Fender stretched. Look at this, guys. I got another Ford Lightning in the box. I've got a, a C10 Harley Davidson with the Harley Davidson trailer. Here's some more customs that I made. I stretched that uh, A model W9. I stretched that day cab W9. Put stacks on both. Lowered this one, lowered this one from the front. Actually customized this baby right here too. Lowered the thing. 
slammed it actually. Kept the original wheels. I've got another Ford Lightning, guys, and this one's dropped completely. This one's just body slammed with the big 20 foes on it. Oh yeah. I actually forgot to mention guys, I had the brown Lindemood as well. I'll post a picture. Um, that brown Lindemood, I actually sold it as well. And I actually sold that one truck for a thousand dollars. We've got another Ford Lightning right here, completely stock red. We've got a Gas Monkey International, Durstar, tow truck. And I've got some more goodies up there on top of the cabinets, guys. My girl is gonna kick me out of the house. Got a blue leasing right there, Hardwick, W900, the pink uh, um, Peterbilt Big Rig Series. Um, I forgot the Peterbilt on that one. Uh, baby blue, low boy, orange low boy. And that's the one that everyone wants, that Kenwood W900 low boy. I almost forgot this video right here, an East Coast large car right there, A cap. And this guy's right here is all my lowrider collection. Danbury Mint, Franklin Mint, Homies, Clown Prince, Bel Airs, Chevys, Goes. I gotta organize, but... Guys, I almost forgot about these right here. I got a Chad Blackwell back there with the homies, the dude polishing it. That's rolling right here. Got some lowriders as well on it. I've got my 124 scale lowriders as well, guys. Look at this beautiful, beautiful Impala. One of my favorites on the 124 scale right here. The 60s. I've got another Impala right here, 64. These are original. This is exactly how they came from the factory. And I've got this rare 124, actually it's a 125 scale Chrome Shop Mafia truck. This baby right here, guys, I got literally when I was a kid when I used to go trucking with my dad over the road. I literally got this at one of the TAs out in Pennsylvania. Years ago, man, years ago. I don't think you guys have seen anything like this in a minute. But this is one of a kind right here, guys. Beautiful truck. I didn't even know what Chrome Shop Mafia was back in the day. Look at that. And this is a piece right here that I will not sell. I got a Travis Scott figure as well from StockX. And I've got some more lowriders right here. We got a 53 Bel Air. Cadillac right there. Drop top. I've got this sick. 63 Impala right here. Radio control homies. With the two homies, uh, 124 scale. Thanks, sick. All original. Got my little hopper right here. Look at that. I used to have a lot of these back when I was a kid, man. These right here. I would always get them at Walmart, right here. Tried organizing a little bit, it was a mess, but we organized somewhat for the meantime. But guys, that is it for the video. Make sure you drop a comment, give me a like, hit that thumbs up guys, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.